Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is your weekly love tarot reading session for you Gemini. I hope you are well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Gemini. This reading for today, this is a love message. This is a love reading for the Gemini sign. Let us see what is happening towards you. What is your weekly love message, okay? This is for the sign of Gemini. Applicable for singles, couples in a relationship, dating, getting to know. This is you, Gemini. Let's see what's coming towards you. So in today's reading, this is a love reading. Thank you guys for coming back. Thank you guys for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Gemini, I invite you to also be part of our mailing list. To do that, the link is down in the description box below. We have a new channel. It is a Next 24 Hours channel. So if you would like to be connected with me on that channel, er everything. <laughs> the details of the channel is down in the description box below. So this is a love reading. Okay, let's see what's coming towards you. What is the message for you guys? What's coming towards you? Who's connecting with you? How they feel about you? How they think about you? Okay. All right. Okay. So you started off Gemini with the page of wands. Um, I feel like Gemini, there was someone in the past that you were engaged or connected or communicating um, if you feel like this person is only giving you the page of wands, like they're kind of on and off or, um, I feel like they have a secret, um, I feel like you have a hunch that this person is possibly, they have another relationship, you know, page, page of wands, I, I'm seeing a person connecting with you again. Hi, hello, maybe more than that, and then they will disappear. I think for some of you, Gemini, you are aware that this person is married or they have a relationship. You could be sitting you could be living in this in this place and the the other party is somewhere there living in another city. So I'm really getting like this I'm I'm getting a third party in here. Okay, for some of you, you're starting to you're starting to realize that why is this person so inconsistent? Sometimes their phone is switched off and then it's it's on like there there's a lot of inconsistency inconsistencies with this person. I'm telling you there's a third party. You know, if you met this person in the in the month of March, in the month of August, October, um I'm seeing this person having a third party. They might have said to you, Gemini, that they no longer have a third party, but they do. And you you are aware of that. Your intuition is telling you that you've got a competition. The justice card, you will discover it soon. Most especially if you are already sleeping together, um, you might see it in their phone, um, something in their... There's, something that you would discover um in their phone in their things that you would it would confirm that aha uh -huh, you have a third party you come to know a secret i would i would really i would be really vigilant because you will discover a secret uh from a person who you suspect there's a third party or maybe you know but they said we stopped it yeah seven of wands you know I feel like if you are going incognito or investigative mode, you will, like, if you really investigate, I don't know, for some of you guys, I'm seeing you following them. There's a gate. This is you. You will really, um, yeah, you will caught them off guard. Yeah, Knight of Cups. So you will caught this person off guard and they will apologize to you and they will still pledge their love to you. And... I'm going to leave it with you and how you're going to deal with this person. But this is, I don't know, the first offense, the second offense, the third offense. But Knight of Cups, how many more of this twinkling eyes and I'm sorry and I beg you. And if they don't change. For some of you, it's not the first time you um, caught this person. 
Four of Wands. The Hierophant card, they are. I'm really getting like, <laughs> I don't know, this person is possibly staying for complacency. But again, it's, it's, it is your, if they want to go exclusive with you, then they need to do the divorce, the processing of the actual divorce and stuff. Um, yeah, I think for some of you, Gemini, you will be, you, you will demand it for some of you. I'm really picking up that you would demand it. I think for some of you, give it a chance. For some of you, it's enough unless they divorce it or unless they prove to you that they will never do it again. Look at that. They're married, you know, but you fall, you know, you, you, you tend to fall in love with this person so quickly that this person has some sort of weakness. You feel like this person is like your kryptonite. So yeah, um, you will caught them off guard. Okay. The next reading, Six of Swords. Um, why do you have this energy? <laughs> So, for some of you, you're like, enough, okay? For, you're dealing with a six of swords, someone younger than you guys. So, younger by at least three, four, five years. You're dealing with this person. Now, you have decided like, okay, no more six of swords. I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on. I really want to have... A clean slate. I want to start all over again. Now, this person this month, they're going to offer you an Ace of Pentacles. Um, you're very sad that you have to completely block them or ignore them. But I feel like it is for your emotional and mental health that you will finally block this person. Okay. It's someone younger than you. Yeah. Yeah, four of cups, like you're no longer going to let them, um, I feel like you're going to block them because they will pursue you and you might take the bait again and then they will frustrate you again and it's not good for you. So you really want, for some of you guys, I'm really picking up that you're determined to forget this person and you can and I think you will. Yeah, temperance card. You are finally letting go of a very toxic cycle or person because you really want to settle and meet the right person for you. You really want the right relationship for you. You don't want to settle anything less than, you know, a relationship. You know, you don't want in between. You don't want platonic relationship. You don't want more than friends, less than lovers. You want the natural organic exclusive relationship so any you will get you're gonna get it you're on the way there um it is sad so no for some of you guys it's really emotional you know there are some times that we met the right person but not the right time it's the right person not the right timing you know and also i don't know, but there's a mismatch of energy between the two of you and i think you're aware of that that mismatch you know there was a mismatch of energy yeah chariot card so you are going to really avoid this as soon as you as soon as this person message you're going to block you're going to avoid it like you have the ego like you've learned your lesson you've 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 learned it the hard way for some of you guys and it's like i don't want to go through it like you for some of you guys you you were traumatized you know queen of pentacles for some of you this person they even ask money you, you're giving them money, you know, you spoiled them, queen of wands, the, you're really like, I would say, you, you know, you are like the queen of wands, the full card, you really supply them, you lavish them, you, know? you lavish them with attention, affection, money, you are the queen of wands, you really made them feel like special, and they will never forget that but they feel but this person is incomplete this person is like a hoarder they hoard they keep they get they get they get but they don't know how to um they receive but they don't know how to give you know yeah king of cups 
you're emotionally connected to them they really make you happy emotionally connected but you do all the work and you're you're kind of done with that i feel like you're a gemini who you're very successful in life i don't know maybe you're a ceo or i don't know but you've got this high ranking position and this person is younger than you not yet stable you i don't know you fell you really fall in love with this person head over heels and right now you are using your intelligent your wit you're being smart because you know that you deserve better better person than this one like you've got like inferiority complex like you are so smart this person is good looking i mean okay witty but not as intelligent as you are and somehow when you were dating this person you lose that side of you that intelligent that wit that smart because of like this whoever this person is like you are a ceo and this person is like um like really just an employee something of that vibe you're really high up there that's what i'm getting mismatch of lifestyle for some of you education so some of you guys but they're very good looking they're very hot they're very sweet and um there's something with them that's really charming like they can you can really connect like there's an inner child that you connect with this person they're very special but they're not they, this is a person that some you know that you could not maintain this kind of like it's it's only one way relationship it's not that you're a very powerful person you need a powerful like you need a power couple or a cup a, a person that would could match your the level of integrity and knowledge and wealth you have for some of you guys queen of wands yeah so the next reading is with the five of swords and a king of swords and a nine of pentacles at the end of this month you have a chance to deal with an ex and then at the end of this month you will also have a chance to meet someone new nine because your nine of pentacles is you you're single ready to mingle um i'm really getting like this is same sex like same gender this the last reading i'm really picking up that you are falling in love but you are attracted sometimes with men sometimes with women so you're going to ha it this is very unique for some of you guys you will have an opportunity at the end of this month to date a man and a woman so you will be able to define your preference something like that it's yeah because nine of pentacles you're single ready to mingle so you you will have that i don't know what you call that and is that bi bisexual i don't know sorry i don't mean to def to offend anybody but like I'm, I'm getting that you you will date an experiment to date men and women um so this is what i have for you gemini thank you so much for being here i hope you have connected with me i hope you've enjoyed the reading i will see you soon again guys you have a great day